Hi, this is Leslie with Riverbend Consulting, and we have three minutes. Three minutes. So, have any of y'all watched 24? I used to love watching 24. Tink, 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 tink. And Jack was always in so much trouble. And because he was on network TV, he would just say, damn it, all the time. It's his curse word. And he would say things like, uh, there's no time. And, you know, where's Nina? And, of course, my favorite, there's a traitor in here. I know there is. Um, so there's a traitor in here. I know there is, is how a lot of people feel when they are working with Amazon Seller Performance because Amazon seller performance can make it really difficult for you with your account if they've suspended your account or suspended an ASIN. And people wonder why it is that when they, when they send a letter to Amazon, um, the responses are nonsensical. They are form letters that don't make sense at all. Sometimes they're not even pertinent to the issue going on. Um, and sometimes they just ask for more information over and over and over over and over again. And so I get a question all the time, what is going on? Why are the responses from seller performance totally nonsensical? Well, we have one minute and 36 seconds left, and that is why the responses don't make any sense. If you work in seller performance, you are supposed to handle 20 transactions per hour. That is three minutes per transaction. How can you evaluate whether someone's account can be reinstated in three minutes? How can you decide whether to suspend an ASIN that the computer system has flagged in three minutes? So what do you do? You clear your queue, give me more information, give me more information, or worse, delete, 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 delete. Keep in mind, a lot of the folks in seller performance, it is their first job out of college. They've never worked in a small business before. They don't know how small businesses operate. They might live in a foreign country, and so the way that businesses work there might be a little different from the way business operates here. And they are under tremendous pressure to make the right decisions. They are judged in their performance evaluations by whether they reinstated the right accounts and didn't reinstate the right accounts. So the next time you're really frustrated with seller performance or any other department at Amazon, remember, keep emails short. The Amazon standard is five sentences or less. If you can't keep it to five sentences, then get the most important information in those five sentences. Add an appendix. Um, and whatever you do, be polite, be kind, and understand, oh, time is up. that the folks in seller performance are under a lot of pressure too. If you'd like more information or help dealing with seller performance, please contact us at Riverbend Consulting. Check out our website, riverbendconsulting.com. We've got a blog there with videos and with text for those who like to read. Uh, we have a YouTube channel, please subscribe to it and follow us on Facebook at Riverbend Consulting LLC. Have a great time selling on Amazon today.